Hey, hey, what's goody, baby? It's Rita. It's real Missy. Girl, I woke up and honestly started exporting videos on my computer. And I really feel like my little thing has truly went out on me. So I just looked them up. They got the little singular ones that are only $10. So I'm excited about that because I'm probably going to go get one of those today. But I still have a babysitter today, so I want to accomplish as much as possible so yeah like comment and subscribe this video yeah like comment and subscribe this video i'm trying to hit 19k before february is up running errands i need to go to the grocery store well not the grocery store because if you know me you know i dislike the grocery store i only really go when it's me and rachel i do most of like my grocery shopping at like target um grow don't judge me i literally hate grocery stores that give me like um it's so much shit it's so many options it's so many people get me out of here so i like target because i can do like my own little thug dizzle and then go over to the you know the little grocery aisle girl and then hit some other shit like it doesn't come across as like grocery shopping it comes off across as like Okay, girl, you just going to Target. <laughs> so, um, I need to go there. I have some stuff I need to take back to the store. And I wanted to edit at my hookah spot. So, yeah, I'm going to get up, shower, the whole nine. Pick out some comfy to run errands in. Yeah, this is a cute run errands day. Because I think I'm going to do my makeup and shit. Um, yeah, just find something cute and comfy to run my errands in. And go on my ass and handle this business before they call me asking, girl, where you at? Come get this baby. Ah, look at Rachel. Ooh. So, um, yeah. Without further ado, like, comment, and subscribe, girl. We finna get it going. We gotta go. Bam. Hey, hey, what's goody, baby? It's Rita. It's Rob. Mizzy, girl. We got some we got some errands to run. Y'all, people been calling my phone. Talking about, do I got money? Do it look like I got some money? Literally, look at me. Do it look like I got some money? Because I fucking don't. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, we finna get going. So, like I said earlier, we just got some little errands to run. It's early as hell, literally. How I like to get my day started, girl. I just like to be home bitch before you know i had to fire the hookah up because like why not like why not but yeah so i'm gonna do just something simple from kid put on me some cute little earring um attire you know the whole name so let's just get it going so Y'all already know I'm starting off with my face. <laughs> so actually, I'm supposed to be mean up to talk to Ken because not mean up to talk to him, but girl, I'm gonna see his ass later because he said that <clears throat> you can't run away. <laughs> girl, he said you can't run away from everything. And I'm just like, bro, you don't even know me. Like, I'm not running away from it. I'm just falling back from it for a minute because he literally like, you've been avoiding me. I told you it wasn't on purpose, yada, yada, yada. And I'm just like, I know it probably wasn't on purpose, but that's not the, oh, hell no. That's definitely not the point. Me putting on foundation before motherfucking moisturizer grow. See, he got me thrown off. Let me get this off. Hold on. Y'all, am I the only one who feel like these makeup that, um, Neutrogena white. They are more drier now. I feel like they used to give me that 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 perfect wetness to like feel like I'm getting my makeup off. Now I just feel like they're so damn dried out. Like I don't like that at all. Neutrogena, go back to the original formula, and I see that they got new packaging too because this is not how it used to look on the front. It's not, but you know, to each his own. Neutrogena handle that for me, cause I love y'all whites. 
but they just not giving what I need them to give. Like, they used to be a little bit more wetter. Like, am I tripping? Or no. But, anywho, y'all. Yeah, I finally ended up texting him because I'm just like, whatever. He was reaching out and shit, and I wasn't responding back. So, then I'm like, damn, really, you're being so childish. But then, at the same time, I'm just like, I just didn't appreciate how everything went down. Um... And he was saying, like, I'm running from the situation. I'm running away from handling it. And it's like, I don't feel like at my big ass age, I'm running away from anything. I just feel like I'm choosing, you know what? I'm choosing what I choose to deal with. Like, I don't want to have to deal with somebody that feel like pulling up on me two hours, zero communication is cool because it's fucking not. Like, it's not. I don't want you to feel like it's cool. I didn't appreciate it. And, yeah, I needed a minute. Um, period. So, anywho, I'm supposed to be seeing him a little later. So, I'm just going to get myself fake cute for that. And, um, we're going to see how that goes. Because, honestly, if we being completely honest, y'all, my hatred level is, bitch, at a zero for these niggas. Like, one fuck up, I'm truly, like, ready to scrap it and get back to myself like i have a good time by myself that's not the problem and i don't have time for the fuck shit so yeah that's what's going on today that's what's going on today mm, 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 mm. And, yeah, anywho, I need another deep caramel. I feel like deep olive is just a little bit too, like, it got a yellowy undertone, but whatever. Today is just whatever. Um, But, yeah, y'all, we're going to get into some things because, girl, the girls are saying that women empowerment brunchers are a fucking scam because it's ran by mean girls and they mean friends pull up. And it doesn't, it doesn't really be about nothing, like, because okay so i ran across the tiktok i'm gonna try to find it actually because i really want to try to see it because this girl was really upset but this is not the first time i have heard like fuck shit about women empowerment brunches that's why i don't condone it any i have got invited to a lot of them girl please i will not i will not be in attendance at that shit um because i just feel like a lot of shit don't be genuine i feel like women try to do that to kind of just act like they for women when really like you're dead ass a mean girl like so yeah um but yeah this girl on tiktok she was talking about how she went to this women empowerment branch she was invited back well she wasn't invited but she seen that uh one of her um like people that she was following was throwing one she like oh my god i would love to meet her be around you know that type of atmosphere of you know women empowering so i'm gonna go ahead and give me a ticket boom she like i should have asked like my friends and shit like if they wanted to go but i knew they wouldn't like personally want to be down so i ended up just getting a ticket and going by myself so she like when i got there so she just was like when i got there like I walk in, I speak to everyone. She like, you know how it's supposed to be that. She like, it didn't give off like. Hold on, y'all. But yeah, she said she walk in or whatever. It's probably a good 50 girls there already. She walk in, hey everybody, how y'all doing? She like literally, I probably heard like three people speak. She like, right then and now, I should have knew this was some BS. She like, but I'm just like, you know what? Maybe they waved. I don't know. I don't care. I'm here to really meet my girl, kind of mingle with her a little bit because this is her women empowerment branch. Boom. So, um, the girl had it set up where it's like two different tables, I guess. Like, she said it was like the ladies who were going to be speaking then the people that just bought regular tickets and then the people that were like older like the older crowd i guess like boom so she thinks she gets the women empowerment branch boom she liked the seats gave she liked the seat lineup gave like cafeteria like 
who do they think they is? She like, it was so much like snickering. She like, it even got to the point where me and another girl noticed that they were kind of like giving a little eye like over there type thing. Like not pointing, but like look over there, look at this, look at that. You know, you know, she like, I'm a person that can fill a room. She like, and I just wasn't feeling welcome. I yada, 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 like. A lot of the, I guess you can call it like Instagram famous or whatever the fuck. She like, they were legit mean girls. Boom. So, she like, now um, time is winding down. The girl who hosted it, like, she was making her grand entrance. You know, X, Y, Z. So, she like, when she comes in, everybody is clapping for her. Woo, 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 standing up. She gets to, um, like, making her around, saying hey to everybody. This is then the third. She, like, and she was walking around with, like, I guess her best friend, like, she, like, and the best friend just gave, like, we're not going to spend too time at the people that pay for the tickets. Like, she, like, when she came over there, don't get me wrong, like, she was cool, spoke, asked us what we did, you know, like, how did we hear about it, shit like that. She, like... But the time I thought, like, she was going to, like, engage or whatever with just almost everybody, I just felt like our table was just talking amongst each other. She, like, and don't get me wrong, even the people that paid for the tickets, they was cool as hell. She, like, but at the same time, we're, we're people that support you. So, of course, we're more so cool. It's like, we genuinely, you know, love and support you. So, you know, boom. She like she was walking around with her friend and the friend when she got up with her to their table like to come and kind of like sit for a minute here come the friend like um yeah like we're about to start um the speeches so can you wrap this up woo 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 she like and I kind of feel some type of way because it's like well as soon as she come back to our table again you want her to wrap it up boom so she like, I'm just like, whatever. After she make her speech, she like, I already knew I was going to be done with it. Woo, woo, woo. So she like, before she started doing the speeches, everybody was like getting a little refreshment so that they could do the toast. Um, like picking out from these three different like wine drinks or whatever type of drinks. And she like, I ended up having to use the washroom. She like, so me and another girl ended up going together and it's like a powder room and then she like it's like a bathroom and she said that like three other girls that was like instagram famous was in there like talking about like people clothes people shoes like why was she wearing a wig woo, woo woo like the theme was blush pink what people don't know they colors like shit like that and i'm just like damn like oh my god y'all when i say i gotta find this fucking video it was crazy but it's so many of them like it's so many women empowerment stories like girl please fucking hashtag fake women empowerment brunch you will fall down the rabbit hole just like i did because it's ran by so many mean girls like don't get me wrong I don't feel like all of them are just a mean girl, the mean girl environment, but I feel like when people feel like they better than, you know, like certain people, then it really comes across. Bitches don't really have, like, literally, a lot of people don't have no personality outside of, like, posting a picture. Like, that is it. That's it. You don't really get to know them because it's a picture. It's a cute little post on an Instagram story. It's a cute little TikTok. But you don't personally know them. So, you making up, like, some type of story in your head. But, truthfully, you just dead ass don't know them. So, she, like, when a little shit happened in the bathroom, I'm like, yeah, I know for sure after this toes, like... I am gone, woo, woo woo Girl, she said she had to unfollow the girl who, you know, she had came for because in her speech, she felt like, and she like, I don't want to seem like, I just feel like we were being targeted, but I did feel like, you know, like, she kept on referencing, yeah, because my friends over here at this table are people to look up to, and this, this, that, and a third, and I, I, like, she kept referencing stuff back to them just, instead of just being like, you know, to be the best woman you can be, then do X, Y, Z, she like, so it just wasn't given, I didn't feel, like, comfortable, I felt like I was low-key being bullied in, like, a calm way, she like, 
right, so girl, I got up out of there. A couple of other girls followed. Um, she like, I ain't gonna lie, I was so hurt that I even wrote this lady. Like, you know, I adored you. This is in the third, but your women empowerment branch really, I feel like wasn't empowering at all. It was a bully session. And it was, you know, let's make fun of XYZ girls. Like, your friends and stuff were so catty. We overheard them talking about the girls in the bathroom. She like, so I just kind of let her know that. Unfollowed her and went on about my way. So, um, she ended up getting cool, I guess, with like two or three of the other girls that, you know, like bought the tickets. And they were saying like, you know, fuck it. Like, we gonna tell her ass about herself too. Cause at first she said the lady responded back like, "LOL, um, I'm sorry you felt that way. I um, it wasn't something." And she like, "Girl, as soon as I said the LOL, I already knew like she didn't give a damn." Woo woo woo, woo and yada yada yada. So I guess this is when she go back and tell, you know, the friends or the people who she met there, and they like, "Oh hell yeah, like." We just gonna make a post about it type shit. And I guess it ended up like blowing up on Facebook or some shit. And um, the lady ended up like issuing an apology. And was like, I won't be hosting any more women empowerment brunches. My goal is not to become, it's not to come across as like a bully or a mean girl. And woo 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 this. And it's just like, bitch. I feel like people know who the fuck they is and why they doing certain shit. They just don't think they're going to get called out on it because of who they are. Um, So I love when like people like me or some like go buy a ticket and then find out that it's fuck shit and then bring light to it. And you know call people out on their shit because if you surrounded by people who feel like this type of shit is okay. You're going to always think like you know it's it's okay and bitch it's not but i'm telling you this is not the first time i have really heard of like a bullshit um women empowerment brunches don't get me wrong i have heard about like some good ones even some good ones that's like here in chicago but it just all depends on you know like the type of person that's throwing it they mood, you know stuff like that i will go to like a something kind of like i don't know I feel like in my age right now, nope, I wouldn't. I'm lying. I don't go to that shit because I just don't. I just never got a good feeling about it. You know when you just like, no. So that's kind of why I just don't go to the shit as a whole. Like, mm -mm. But that story really had me in a choke up because it wasn't the first time. But it was just like, damn. Like, the girl, like, I was really excited to go. Like, <laughs> really excited to go. And meet this woman and hear what she had to say and it just didn't give and i'm like damn that's fucked up because that's how you lose like people who genuinely support you with a fucked up attitude with fucked up friends like you are who you hang around dead ass like in certain instances <laughs> you know what but no like seriously in that instance like come on now y'all think y'all better than somebody like no mm -mm. Mm -mm. so girl i'm like we gonna talk about it because i hear a lot of people say that though like women empowerment brunches aren't a, as what they you know cut out to be and all this other you know jabbing shooking whatever the fuck and it's just like that's so unfortunate because you have a lot of young girls that like this lady wasn't like she was younger than me so you have a lot of young girls who look up to people and it's like when they meet you you're a, you're a shit show it's like what it, it's it's irritating it's irritating so have y'all ever been to one that's what i really want to ask have y'all ever been to one and did you feel like you know it was worth did you had a good time or did you feel like like mm -mm, this not it type shit This brow arch has always been just naturally higher than this one. 
Girl, I just learned to stop giving a damn at this point. <laughs> I did. I learned to stop giving a damn. Looking like it's gonna be a good Friday. Oh y'all, I'm not sure if y'all watch Real Housewives of Potomac, but this shit has been so damn funny. Like, honestly, like I'm not never one to like laugh at someone's like pain or anything, but. I don't even feel like this is necessarily like pain because girl if you don't walk away from that shit y'all Robin so Robin Hole little storyline is season has been being a fucking mean girl with Giselle and girl everybody else been clocking her ass about it because they like girl you need to be quiet because your husband and you not even really getting married like girl this is a fucking facade and it came about that Robin on um, husband, girl, or fiance, whatever you want to call his ass, he had flew a girl from Canada over there to Potomac chair and bought her a room. So now Robin humped her ass on her podcast talking about she knew about it and all this other shit. And it's just like, girl, go to hell. It was for the friend. Well, why the friend didn't use his car? Why one use his car? Like, make it make sense. So, boom. She got on her little podcast because her and Giselle got like a little podcast. And they was talking about it and shit on there. And then Andy just had her on his show. And he like, yeah, are you going to like elaborate? Because, girl, everybody is thinking that this girl is, you know one's boo thing and she like no it's nothing like that like she was talking to one of his friends and she supposedly lost her wallet like when i say this shit legit just sounded like a bold face like it's like come on now if anything if you're gonna be anything be fucking for real like y'all i'm like she cannot be believing this shit that is coming out of her own mouth. Like, you cannot be believing this shit. So, I'm like, girl, go to hell. Like, mm-mm, we don't, we don't believe you, Pookie. And it's just like, why the fuck is you sitting up here at your big ass age lying? Girl, if you don't like that damn man. And I didn't never know y'all that Juan said if it wasn't for his kids, he would have been loved. Like, don't get me wrong. People separate, come back, you know, the whole name. But I ain't gonna lie. It's looking real poo shiesty with them. And it's just like, girl, hang it up, Robin. Fuck it. Just hang it up. Start over. Get a new man. Like, why not? It, it, it just don't, it don't really give with him. Like, mm-mm. It's not giving, poo. So... I really want to know, like, y'all thoughts. Do y'all really feel like she is telling the truth? Why? And her, you know, disgust this. This is just one of his friends, bulls. Or is, like, y'all seeing through the fuck shit like me? Like, girl, no. No. No, Robin. No. And they be trying to come for Karen, girl. And it's just like, don't come for that lady. Leave her alone. I like Karen. Karen is one of my favorites. I'm not going to hold you. Karen is one of my favorites.
to the bottom. Go to the bottom. I'm excited to see we're gonna perform this for Super Bowl. I don't even really care about the Super Bowl, but um Yeah, I'm excited. I wanna see what songs and shit she gonna do. I'm excited for her to be back on stage after my granny had her baby. Like I'm rooting for you, sis. And that's my Pisces sis. That's my Pisces sister. Okay. <laughs> Let's do the nose real quick. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go to the hookah spot. I'm not gonna have enough time. <sighs> and I really wanna finish watching Lego Master. And I wanna fucking start watching season two of Vikings and Valhalla. Vikings of Valhalla, I mean. So, yeah. My face is getting so brown. God damn. God damn. Good guy, damn. Girl, it's my scarf moving back for me. Like, come on now. I don't know if I'm gonna wear this hat or do I just wanna wear my leave out. I'm kinda feeling like the leave out type of thing because y'all that wig haven't been curled in so long. Like it holds a curl so damn good. Um so I'm really just loving like the little loose curl way type of thing. So I think I'm gonna just keep thugging it with the curls for a minute. <laughs> I love the way my makeup looked on my pictures I took. But oh they look if my makeup looked is so flawless. Like, I can tell the difference. Don't you like when you switch up your makeup and you can tell in photos? Like, oh I love it so bad. Like that was me. Like, oh Rita, we love that. Ouch. Oh, speaking of those pictures, I need to post those on YouTube. Because a lot of my people that's on YouTube, not on Insta. But yeah, I'm going to get ready with me on TikTok today for this little earring outfit. You know, get it. I feel like when I put effort into like my, um, like when I'm going out to rent errands, I be feeling like, girl, the world is fucking mad. Even if I am going in there for a fat all of the earring rack of tail, I was like, who cares? Yeah, gotta put the blush on the nose today. Okay, let's pop some color in this tear duct and call it a day. Pop these lashes on. Um, what was the, 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 my sis, Yummy Brit, shout out to you. She was like, girl, you don't set, and I stopped setting, and bitch, I'm never using setting spray again. And I'm just like, I just like not setting my face because I just feel like it's gonna do what it needs to do throughout the day. Don't get me wrong, I used to legit love setting my face, girl, spraying the face down, but I just really be like, I don't need it, not right now. Um, don't really care to add it to my makeup routine. I haven't been doing it, so I'm just like okay with it as of right now. But yeah, I just feel like I don't I don't have a reason why I don't say. I just don't anymore. I just don't feel like I need to say so that part. <laughs> I look crazy as hell. Um with this scar tie like this. But yeah. I'm just going to pop these lashes on real quick and then we're going to head on out. Let's go. Go, 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 go. That song really did what it needed to do for the summer. I'm so proud of her. I'm so proud of both, all of them, sure. They all doing their thing, you hear me? So. It did what it needed to do for the summer, cause baby, 
I had a few nights when I was hanging out the window for sure. I had a good time this summer. I finally went my ass outside. And I think I'm gonna set my ass down this summer. It's like one summer on, one summer off. Like, mm -mm. can't do too many turnt summers at my age, girl. You just can't. You just fucking can't. Like, I don't know. The difference of a lash. I love the girls though that um don't have to wear lashes. I think I said that before. I love the girls that don't have to wear like lashes to make their makeup look cute. Like I love it. They be looking so cute. Um, I'm probably never gonna go back to like the big lashes, y'all. And this is just my preference now. Like these are legit big enough. Like I used to wear the ones that touch my eyebrow. Bitch, if you let me know. So, it's like, nope. I'm out of that error. And, yeah. But, yeah, these are so cute. Now, I'm about to cook a trend through my hair. And I'm checking back in, child. already out of storage like what the fuck yeah a couple of my girls in the back fail so I'm trying to really saying keep them looking cute anywho y'all um I'm on my way to take these pictures back because they just do not look cute on my wall like at all they are just too plain I thought that would be so cute for the summer like spring vibe but Mm, it didn't really give so <laughs> girl they going back to the store i feel like i can do better i was settling and i feel like i haven't got the heat yet because it haven't heated up yet but yeah i'm gonna take those pictures back to the store i have to run to target and then we gotta you know get our groceries yada 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 yeah just running some little minor errands i need to stop at the hookah store before i go back home because I'm out of my shisha that I've been liking, which is ice cream, y'all. It is so damn good. Um, so yeah, that's all that's going on today. I need to sit down somewhere and edit this fucking TikTok. Like, seriously. I don't know if I'm gonna go smoke hookah or not. It depends on the time that I'll finish like running my errands and stuff. That matcha is delicious. Um, I saved my matcha. I told y'all I was gonna save it for today. Um, but yeah, that's how this one on today. And then I gotta, you know, oh god, he just texted me. I'm just like, oh. I don't know, y'all. I feel like, no, once you do, I don't know. I'm not saying F him, but I am at the same time. So it is what the fuck it is, okay? I look good though, so you know when you look good, you be like, nigga, what? Nigga, who? You will pull up, you know, talking your shit. Like, that's the type of time I'm on. I'm really from the pop my shit. I feel like he not expecting what I got to say to be said today. He's not going to be expecting it. So, yeah, that's what we are doing. I was going to run to the mall, but honestly, like, no, I'm not. I'm going to wait because I have, like, three weeks until my birthday and it's just like Rita I am literally like trying to wear as much stuff as possible so that I can have a reason to shop because I don't have any clothes like me going to a shop saying like oh my god I don't have nothing it's like it's insane so I'm gonna stay away from that for a minute because like after my birthday of course I'm gonna take myself on a little shopping spree, we're gonna do our whole little Nizzy, and um, yeah, I'm really just trying to get everything in order today as far as like getting my household stuff and getting my groceries. And if I have a little playtime after, then I'll go hookah. I went mad popping up in that, so I just might, but I'm really trying to see where do I want to go first? Do I want to work my way down, then back up, or? 
that's not um, one of these stores out there. I think that is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to Target first. I'm gonna go to Target first for sure. Oh no. I'm gonna start low and then I'm gonna work my way back up. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Period. I need to get like a little metal thing for my camera because when I be hitting these fucking bumps and bumps, it be picking it up on the camera and I hate that thing. But yeah, I check back in with y'all in a minute. My car is dirty as shit. Like everybody else in the everybody else in a gas station car was like at least decent. Then here go me with my girl. We looking oh hell no. I'm going to get a car wash stack. Hell no. Hell no. Uh uh. No, but seriously, my car is dusty as hell. Like, if I don't do shit today, I'm getting a car wash. What? I'm getting a car wash. My car is so like, it's a dust bucket. I'm fucking crying. It's literally been been through hell and back. What the fuck? So that's what we're gonna do today as well. You know? We're gonna take care of the things that we need to take care of, girl. I'm looking good. I can't be riding a dusty ass car. But y'all, the Chicago weather has been a fucking joke. Like today and yesterday was like the first stand still decent days. It's been raining on and off, snowing on and off, cold. Like so, yeah. If I'm gonna get one, I'm gonna get one today. My car is so dusty though. That is hilarious because I look like a million bucks. And my bitch look like I just got her from under a sawdust. Me. Like, pull her from out of sawdust. It's crazy. But yeah, I'm on my way to the first destination. I was going to start up, work my way down, then come back up. But I'm like, hell no. Because once I'm up, I'm up. Once I'm up, it's stuck. Okay? So I'm going to just go down and then come back up. That's what I'm gonna do. Stuff. Okay, let me take this shit back. Hello. So I'm actually supposed to be signing Okay. Don't give me like a nice little candle, but they suck. 
So, so yeah, I'm gonna just every tiny shit I got in here too, cause no, I don't really got nothing today. Oh, that's cute. It's a juicy couture bed spread. That's cute. I just am into more of the simple things. Oh my god, I need one of these. Okay, I should get this. Yeah. I just was saying I need like a jewelry stand. And they got the little ring stand. How cute. Should I get that? No, 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 no. Okay, Aldo. Cute little spring light. Love that. See, it ain't over the cash yet. Oh, these are so cute for Valentine's Day. I might get these. I'm not gonna hold you. I feel like anything else, I would just be buying shit and no. I only am returning this little bird thingy and then this because the bird is dirty as hell. The bird was legit dirty, y'all. Like, it got like a dirt stain on it. I don't know how I missed it the first time, but. I missed it and no. Okay, come on, Burberry. Ouch. Little Burberry bag. <laughs> Period. Hold on, fit check. Okay, let's go. Let's get up out of here. The shit I was gonna do, girl, we gotta reroute for another day. Cause I was gonna go to Target and do my little do deals up and up. But y'all, I haven't posted on YouTube in four fucking days. Girl, what the fuck is wrong with you? You don't reward yourself, bitch. You haven't been doing anything. Nah, but um, I'm finna meet Rachel and them. So I'm like, I might as well go to Jewels. Honestly, I love this Jewels. I'm not gonna hold you. I be getting sushi the whole night from here. Like, if I'm gonna do a Jewels, this is a jewel. So I'm like, fuck it. Let's see where she at. So, um, yeah. I'm just about to go there, drop this off to Rachel, go my ass home because yeah, time, time is getting away from the girl, and I need to go home and edit y'all. I did not know it's been four fucking days since I posted. Like, what? But now, nah, um. Once I went low, I'm like, no, I'm not going back up. So, since I gotta take Rachel this, I might as well just go to Jewel. So, that's where I'm on my way to right now. I'm trying to make me some sliders tonight. I'm so excited because I be smoking them fucking sliders. They be so damn good. So, I'm trying to go ahead and do that. And edit and watch a little movie or something. Like, you know. You know, uh, but yeah, I need to get to work. Like, what the fuck? Hello? Hello? Martha, where are you? I'm, I'm going to Jules. My mom and Rachel so funny. So, anywho, y'all, that's what's going on. I need to get to work. It was a cute little errand day. Yeah. Up for now. Cause it's like once I finish with his ass, like the day is gone. Like if I would have went to Target, like mm -hmm. so I just had to reroute my plan just a tad bit so that I can be on point. Because yeah, I need to upload today. 
I need to upload today. I don't give a fuck. So I'm hoping to be back home at like four. It's 1.30 right now. So I'm gonna go grocery shopping, meet up with him, and then literally I should fold 30. And then yeah. Yeah. Like 4 30. I think we're gonna meet at a little um, I think we're gonna meet at like a little chicken sandwich place. Cause today is getting away from me. Ugh, I hang in. I got too much to do. But it was productive for the most part. It still is productive because I'm literally like got two more things to do and then go home and edit. Okay, so yeah. But yeah, Target was way out the way because I would have still girl listen, like all that. Um I just uploaded a TikTok so Go ahead and check that out for your girl. <laughs> Love that for y'all. I do this for y'all. It ain't about me, baby. It ain't about me. Damn, it's like long. <sighs> I'm so hungry. So I'm really trying to be on time to get my little hot chicken sandwich. That bitch gonna be so good. Yeah, I'm gonna make me some slides. If I don't make them today, yeah, because I'm going to make them today. Because if I eat like around 3, I know for sure once I'm done editing and doing everything by like 6, 7, I'm going to want to eat Put some more food on my stomach. Blah, 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 blah. So, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait. Let me okay, y'all. Here at Jules. Time to get some freaking groceries. Because bitch, the refrigerator is not flooded, okay? The bitch is a desert. It's a desert. about Valentine's Day. Forget love. I don't believe in Cupid. That's just stupid. Which garlic am I supposed to get? Chop. I think I'm supposed to get minced. Okay, let's get some stuff. 
I'm gonna check back in with y'all because literally I need to focus or I'm gonna forget something at this damn grocery store. adorable it's Starbucks oh those are cute oh shit so hot got my groceries job well done on that I've been outside for three fucking hours. Like, what? Rachel's talking about she want matcha. Like, bro, I never buy these because they're so fucking tiny. Damn, they want $13 for those? Go to hell. Go to fucking hell, okay? $13. That's two drinks. Hi, how are you? I'm good. I'm good. Can I have two um, matcha green tea lattes, Venti? Ice, but with no ice, please. And then eight pumps of vanilla added to both as well. Fuck I expected. Like, period. Why the fudge did I just forget that I needed to get that piece from the store for my freaking computer? Like, oh my god. Oh my gosh. So, yeah. Anywho, I'm on my way home. I don't care. I'm tired and yeah, I'm over y'all. Like, uh, Ken is done. Like, he's done. He's just done. Like, I don't understand. You want to know what I don't like when people don't know when they wrong? Like, literally, the man talked in fucking circles and it's just like you're a grown ass adult. Um, no. Communication is key. It's like, have y'all ever talked to somebody like, they, they be like, yeah, I totally understand, but, bitch, ain't no but, ain't no but. If you understand what I'm saying, where I'm coming from, we move forward, bitch, or we don't, okay? Like, what? Like, I hate the but, because there's no but. I'm telling you how I feel, period. That's it. I don't even care. We only been talking for almost, like, what, a month? Like, go to hell. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> like, bro, you're not listening to what the fuck I'm saying. Because you feel like you can come back with something that's like, oh, yeah, you're right. Like, no, you're not right. It's only one wrong and one right, babe. And I'm the right. You're the wrong. Go to hell. So, anywho, y'all, I'm on my way home. Love that for me because I'm on great time right before it gets dark. Love that. Love that. A little low key irritated, but then I'm like, Rita, you don't have no reason to be irritated, babe. That's not your man. You never did nothing with that man. You don't know that. You know what? Like, 
I'm beating his mama ass. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But seriously, it's just like, he's like, can I call you in a minute? No, you cannot call me in a minute. I'm not going to answer. You can call in a minute. The question is, will I be answering in a minute? Which is no. But anyhow, y'all, I'm on my way home. Love that for me. I'm probably going to stop and get some shisha from the store. And then, yeah, go home. I load my groceries. I was so irritated. Like, I was barely even eating my food. So, I don't even think I'm going to cook tonight. Like, I was so irritated. But, yeah. Um, So, yeah, I'm excited to be going home. That's for damn sure. But I forgot the piece. But good thing, I already converted one video over already. So this one, I might need to either try to finesse it one more time. So I'm back home. This is literally the next morning. I'm about to get ready and run some more, you know, errands, do some more things. But yeah, I love y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this video. And I will see y'all in the next one.